guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is p elizabeth today i'll be sharing some information on the frequently asked questions about the covid 19 vaccine we'll be receiving here in ghana the astrozeneca vaccine let's get right into the video i will start with what a vaccine is so a vaccine is any substance introduced into the body to stimulate your immune system to produce antibodies we have different types of vaccines for different purposes and for different diseases. But when it comes to the COVID-19, we have two different types of vaccines for it. We have the mRNA vaccine and the viral vector vaccine. In Ghana here, we're receiving the AstraZeneca vaccine, which falls under the viral vector vaccine. These vaccines do not affect our DNAs or give us the COVID-19 infection at all. Even though the COVID-19 virus affects everybody from any age range, the vaccine, which is the AstraZeneca vaccine, can only be given to people who have attained 18 years of age and above. The vaccine is given in two different doses, the first shot and the second shot. Everyone is required to have two shots of the vaccine in order to have the full effectiveness of the COVID-19 vaccine your first shot and your second shot. After taking your first shot, you're supposed to wait for four weeks to 12 weeks to receive your second shot. Within a span of four weeks to 12 weeks, you do not have the full um, protection until you have taken your second shot, then you can say you have your full protection. But even with the full protection, talking of percentage wise, the vaccine companies assure you of up to a 95% prevention for mild and moderate COVID infection. The vaccine is supposed to be given on your upper arm using the intramuscular route. With every vaccine, there are sure to be some side effects and there are certain side effects with the COVID-19 vaccine. Some of them are very common and then some are very rare. With the common ones, you're usually one out of 10 people would usually have pain, warmth, or tenderness at the site of injection. They may have headaches, they may have chills, um, they may feel fatigued, or sometimes they may have muscular pain. With the uncommon side effects of the AstraZeneca vaccine, one in 100 people may um, usually have dizziness, abdominal pain, enlarged nymph nodes, decreased appetite, and then excessive sweating, itchiness, or a rash on your skin. There are particular warning and precautions you should take before you take the vaccine. Um, if should you have had any allergic reaction to any vaccine at all other than the COVID-19 vaccine, you should inform your doctor, your nurse, or your pharmacist who will be administering the vaccine to you. If you have also had or currently having a severe infection with a temperature of 38 degrees Celsius and above, you should inform your doctor, your nurse or your pharmacist before receiving the vaccine. People with um, low immunities are also supposed to inform their healthcare provider before receiving the vaccine. If you're having a problem with bleeding, or you're on anticoagulants, you should also inform your health provider before taking the vaccine so that all the necessary measures will be taken before you find yourself wanting and having any serious side effects. We should note that there are not any data currently for the usage of the COVID-19 vaccine for children below 18 years of age. As with any vaccine, the COVID-19 vaccine AstraZeneca, which we are receiving here in Ghana, may not protect everybody against the COVID-19 virus. And it is also not known how long one will be protected from the virus after taking the vaccine. Nevertheless, this does not prevent us from taking the vaccine, as it gives us about a 60 to 95% prevention of the COVID-19 virus. The chief reason for receiving the AstraZeneca vaccine is to be able to acquire immunity against the COVID-19 virus. And then this gives the opportunity for our T lymphocytes and B lymphocytes to hold on to a memory in remembering how to fight the 
virus in the future. Everyone will still have to use their face masks, practice washing of hands, practice social distancing even after receiving the vaccine because it takes a while for you to acquire those antibodies you would need to fight off the COVID-19 virus. However, we still know that it doesn't provide 100% um, immunity against the COVID-19 virus. Please do not be scared to take the vaccine. As all vaccines development are carefully evaluated in clinical trials and are very safe for use. I would leave down below in the description box some links where I took my information from so that you can read further on the COVID-19 vaccines we have available and especially on the AstraZeneca vaccine we have here in Ghana. Thank you for watching my video and if you have any questions kindly leave it in the comment box below and also subscribe to my channel, leave a like if you do like the video, share it so other people can know about the AstraZeneca vaccine we are taking here in Ghana and then they can fully understand what a vaccine is, what they are receiving, how it is working and then what it will do for them. Thank you all. Bye. Thank you.